So we're into the last three missions of the game, everybody. Here you can grab a Devil Star for backup. Uh, I don't really think you'll need it. <coughs> so switch back to a last door, and then Stinger jump over to here. Now this next movement technique is the most optimal way to get through this room. Uh, you can go the slower way if you're worried about not having Devil Trigger to vortex through the living cave. But ideally, as long as you have um, six... As long as you have six runes here, you should be able to do this just fine. So you'll vortex across, and then you'll wait to hear your vortex hit twice. And then you'll deactivate Devil Trigger and Helm Break. And then as soon as that's done, turn back around, and then Stinger Jump off. So that Dante is going through the Stinger Jump animation during this cutscene, which is unskippable. Then you can just wall hike up and then go out, exit out of the room. So we're just going to watch that again, just so that you guys have an idea of what's going on. So, Vortex, 1, 2, Helmbreak, Stinger Jump. And then just wall hike back up. You can grab the Holy Water here for backup. You can, you'll be using it on the final mission. So, that's good. Then you just want to vortex through here. And I'm going to show you two different cycles that you can do on the nobodies. One is a little bit safer and will build you more Devil Trigger. But the other one does more damage and will still build you a decent amount of Devil Trigger. So the first version here, uh, I just start doing Grenade Gun Stinger in order to kill the nobody. And it built me quite a bit of damage, or built me quite a bit of DT, as well as dealing a lot of damage. And then as soon as you vortex through here, here's the other cycle. So you do two hits of Air Raid, deactivate Flight, come on, and then you do a Grenade, and then one Stinger, deactivate, and then do the regular combo from there. Grenade Stinger, Grenade Stinger. <coughs> Excuse me. And then that version will kill them faster. Then you're just going to want to grenade. If I hadn't gotten hit here, by the way, this would have been an S rank. So then you just want to vortex on through with better movement than me here. And then just grenade Stinger. I am very fortunate to not have had these guys troll me while on this recording the way that they have in the past. These guys will kick you around and those noodles on the wall will randomly be your priority target and that's just not a fun day. But sometimes those, those nobodies will just kick you in the face and there's nothing you can do about it except take it. So then you want to vortex across here and then use your vortex to activate the light wheel. Jump onto here, jump here, and then there's another one that, jump, that pops up here. There's another platform. You can wait for it if you want to. But optimally, you just want to air hike. Don't bother with this this orb crystal. And don't bother with this unless you want to play safe, this light wheel, because there's another platform that comes up. So then you just want to air hike again. And then jump here. Now, I have this listed, this stinger to the, the flesh door as RNG. And it's less RNG, and it's more in the way that you move through the room. If you move through it fast, you're going to be able to do this, like, every time. Um... However, I've seen cases where, like, people get hype over doing this, and I, because, like, I guess the bats just randomly will become a priority target for Dante, even though they're all the way at the bottom of the room. So, there's the, the stinger to the, the flesh door. Uh, as long as you move as quickly as possible through the room, you'll be alright. Here, I stopped to actually check how many Devil Stars I had, because you need four Devil Stars for the um, the untouchable version of the Sparta fight. For the other version that I'm going to show you, you need six. Five or six. So, Stinger, Melee Stinger. Then Stinger jump off, and then you can pretty much immediately activate the door to Mundus. You don't have to wait for all of those hands to go away. <coughs> 